Wait for it. Wait for it. Derek from on the water. What's up, man? We're I like, got you, your dog. Oh my goodness, it. Derek. That's yours with your name on it. This one has my name on it? Yeah. Oh my goodness, dude. Wow. I probably should have worked alongside Josh prior to going to Miami to showcase the Reuben dog because uh, my, my plate presentation just wasn't there. Um, Josh showed me that. The melted Swiss with sauerkraut definitely, definitely took it up a notch. And if you're wondering where you get it, you can only get it at the River Dog Stadium right now. So all you Charlestonians, go right ahead. Go hop on down to the Joe and get you some. <laughs> get you some. Get you some, huh, Mayor? All right. All right, man. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that kraut mixed in with the Swiss. Great. It's a whole nother level. So we'll drop another episode with Josh at the Joe making the Reuben dog, kind of walking you through the process. Fishman Joe in the house! Andy from the Menorcan Money! Good to be here. Heck hey. of a party. Yo. This party I've been to in a very long time. Listen. I mean, he's got an alligator, bro. For it. Alfred, you didn't, you, you Listen, killed this. No, bro, respect. when doesn't Alfred, when, when doesn't Alfred kill it? Alex! Alex, what, what, what did you bring? What did you bring? This amazingness. This is your, your favorite book. Is this the one that I wrote? Yes, man. You alligator. <laughs> Andy Jones. Fishman Joe, Alex, all of them came. Boy, do you know how to build a community. Yes, yes, I'll give you a quick sneak peek at the messy, messy kitchen. It's coming along, but it's still not there. So I got a flat top. I'll let you know what's in that box later. The fryer, the chef base, and the freezer, and a whole bunch of other randomness. It just rains and is hot every day in Charleston. So I haven't really been getting too much done. Got to go on the road again for work. Um, so uh, I know I have a lot of work to do. I gotta get this thing on the water so I finally get on the water myself and get to cranking out episodes. I owe it to you. Definitely owe it to you. Instead of sitting here in a flat of pluff mud, that's what that is in case you don't know the low country. Surrounded by pluff mud. So down here in Miami, went to Alfred's event last night. Figured come out and say hey at, uh, at the landing before leaving. And um, there's somebody else setting up in this spot. Good, Alfred. We're down here at Black Point Marina. We're taking over the Chicho. Andy, Andy might be a little bit afraid to go take the territory just yet because some of Alfred's loyals have already been called out. Some of you ran over there. Been here, been here like no, no kidding. Camera set up for 30 seconds. I've already been called out. Somebody pulls up, and goes, "Welcome to the Chicho," and then he asks, "Where's his hat?" I got a question for you. Yeah. Is that right there, the mangrove? Yeah. It is. You know it's what? I protected plant. I kind of want to take it home with me. Don't do that. I really, really want a mangrove. It would mean a lot to me. Not the place. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, look what's here! Maybe your entrance wasn't that dramatic, but it was pretty freaking dramatic. Thank God you didn't run me through with the sword. Ha ha! You guys want to go live? Do Chicho Interactive? I, I, think, I think you need to rock, paper, scissors Andy for the spot though. He's already like steak. Andy's already staked there, right? He's already staked it, so you two now need I get to... behind him. Look what this guy did! Look what he did! <laughs> and before you know it, there's a riot in South Florida. The mayor says things have gotten out of control. What started as a peaceful protest quickly escalating. <laughs> A crowd of people in panic fleeing for cover. The chaos on the streets of South Florida yesterday. No, go do, do what you're doing, you. Wait, wait, hold on. Derek just got his camera. Now he's filming me work. You, man, you have me. Well, people say you don't work, so I just. I, I do work. Look, I'm sweating. I know. I see it. Fortunately, there were no riots. Did have a lot of fun working alongside Alfred that day, though. I say working. It was not work. It was for him. 
Uh, we were just there, he's an excellent host, learned a lot. Wanted to just go over a couple of the key pointers and takeaways that we learned. It's, it's nice to have uh, YouTubers next to me, right? So, first of all, how was the event yesterday? Did you guys enjoy yourselves? Fantastic, first class. Is it, is it, wasn't it a cool event? Oh, like, it was great. You guys, and, and let me tell you, you brought, you brought some stuff to grill. You killed it. I mean, what were the ones that I liked? It's all Cooper River Farm products. Okay, okay. And this is not sponsored, guys. No. He brought stuff from South Carolina and, and you hooked it up at the party. I had my own food, I had the Cuban side yes, of it, you and you guys fell in love with what? Oh. Maduros. Oh, you yeah. guys, you guys, these guys ate maybe about 20 pounds of <laughs> Maduro. I'm telling you guys, vanilla ice cream. With that, oh. you're inventing yeah. something that we don't do here. Oh, you, gotta you gotta add something crunchy too, because you always gotta worry about texture when you're doing it. I don't know what crunchy would be. Open to suggestions, but. Okay, so that, you know what? I can see I can see somebody enjoying that, right? Because it's soft, yeah. and then you have a crunchy outside with a dip of a vanilla ice cream. Dude, oh, you just man. you just made every Cuban in Miami fatter. Those Maduros were unbelievable, and Andy, you were exactly, exactly right. A little ice cream, something salty, something crunchy. I didn't make every Cuban fatter. I made myself fatter. I mean, how cool is it to have Andy from the Menorcan Mullet and that incredible series in St. Simon Sound. Listen, you deserve an Alfred Emmy. We'll call it something, we'll, we'll call it an Alfred Chit something. Because I'll tell you, I have never, and I don't think I will ever see somebody do something that amazing in my lifetime. And I can honestly say that. Alfred, did you just make a new event? I did. Do we have to get custom made, trophies made, and at the end of the year, at the end of the season, I, you why, not, awards. why not? I why not? I am talking chip. You do definitely need to do the Chip Show Award Show, though. It needs to be an event. You can live stream it, but people want to see you, man. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. An alligator. An alligator at that event. I can't imagine what you would do for your award show. Three. What was three? Oh, the SD card. Look, this is, this is, you see these guys, you never waste SD card on a flats fisherman. And then if a flats fisherman messes up at the dock, 100% the boat is stolen. The SD card does not go to waste when you film flats boats in South Carolina. It may not be stolen, it may be the infamous daddy's boat. Oh, the water's coming back in. I think overall it was a great time, had a lot of fun working alongside Andy and Alfred. Loved it down there in Florida, back here in Charleston, trying to get this boat done so we can get on the water. Uh, until then, uh, see you around, maybe. Start making some more episodes. And uh, YouTube thinks you like this one next, so. Click.